I've always been interested in primary care as long as I've wanted to go to medical school, which for me has been for most of my life. Um, I'm interested in primary care because of the relationships it allows you to build with your patients. Hopefully, for some patients, relationships that would span years. Even as a pediatrician, you would span a child's entire youth and adolescence. Or with family medicine, you could treat someone for years and decades, hopefully. Um, so that long-term relationship is what is my primary interest in primary care. Why more people don't want to be doctors? Because if it's something I'm so passionate in, what is it that's scaring other people off from, from this, this career path? But I guess, especially in terms of primary care, um, it's also, it's also really scary in terms of something that's something that I'm really interested in and it's also some, a field that a lot of doctors are, are not going into and are actively leaving. Um, so it makes me, I don't know, everything I read about primary care makes you kind of shy away from it. So, so it's kind of scary. I think it's a high salary, I mean it's a high salary that you could get in a specialty and not just high salary. Well there's another aspect of that and that I don't think a lot of med students, some, but not all, are want to make the most money they can, but we do, we're going to exit school with a, a lot of loans, $150,000, $200,000 worth of loans, and we're going to need to be able to pay those back, especially with people like me. I have loans from my undergraduate, which are just going to, they're just going to be compounded, and that's, that's scary and intimidating. So the salary is part of it, but I think also with um, working into a specialty, you get a different quality of life, or you can get a different quality of life if you have a nine to five job and you don't work on the weekends and you don't have on call, you don't make house calls, that's something that can be really attractive to, to people.